HSC TV and HSC News are public forums for student expression. Students make all content decisions and opinions expressed do not represent those of HSC schools or the Board of School Trustees. Good afternoon, Royals. I'm Ryson. And I'm Audrey, and this is your daily newscast for September 11, 2018. Today's newscast is brought to you by Catherine Sheely Photography, where you receive the senior pictures you've always imagined. Fall dates are now available, so be sure to get yours by messaging at Hey Catherine Sheely before space is gone. Juniors and seniors who hold an office in the school or in the community are eligible to apply for the chance to win an all-expense paid trip to Washington, D.C. and a $10,000 college scholarship through the Senate Youth Program. If please see Ms. Chandler in B159 for an application. Tickets for this year's Dancing Through the Decades Homecoming Dance will be on sale at lunches September 17th through the 21st for $10 each. You must show a current student ID in order to purchase a ticket. Colleges visiting the next few days include University of Indianapolis, Villanova University, New York University. Find specifics and sign up for college visits and guidance or on Naviance. Project Hope is having a call out tomorrow at 3.05 p.m. in F236. Follow them on Instagram at project underscore hope HSC. A new group called SAFE creates a space for all voices to be heard. Come to the call out meeting tomorrow at either 7 a.m. or 3 p.m. in J126. See Ms. Torres in J126 with questions. HSC Royal Students for Life is having a call-out meeting tomorrow from 3 to 4 p.m. This is open to all students interested in learning more about projecting life at all ages and stages of life. There will be a political discussion club today in Mr. Mayor's room, day 224 after school. All students are welcome. The first FFA meeting will be today at 6.30 p.m. in A128. Learn how to be involved in the largest youth-led organization. Follow the link below to sign up for World Connections Club. Pay your dues to Mrs. Lazaga in A112. The first event is this Friday for Indian Food Night in the LGI room right after school. If you missed the first Creative Writing Club meeting but want to be involved, sign up on the sheet outside B128. See Ms. Q if you have questions. Any students who want to join the Disney Club can stop by Mr. Fallis room J107 to get a form or come to the call-up meeting after school this Thursday to learn more. And now over to your sports. How's it going, Royals? Welcome back. I'm Tony Kassiri. And I'm Gavin Thomas. And you are tuning in to SSN, your number one source for all Royal Athletic News. Show us some love and give us a follow on Twitter, at Southeastern Capital S Capital N. Now on to your news. But first, the next Mudsock match is in 93 days, 18 hours, 58 minutes, and 20 seconds. All righty. Over the weekend, uh, the Lady Royals volleyball team defeated Pendleton Heights in straight sets to improve to 13-4 and four on the season. Taylor Shelton had a strong night offensively with 16 kills and wow. 13 digs. Akenna Pyle led the Royals from behind, serving the line with five aces. Nice job, ladies. Boys tennis beat Garen Catholic last night 5 to nothing. Congratulations to Aiden DeWitt, who pulled out a clutch tiebreaker win. Great job, boys. All right, tonight, show up for your varsity boys soccer game at 7 p.m. as they take on Westfield at home. Good luck, boys. That's all we have for you today, Royals. Now back to your main anchors. That's it for today, Royals. Have a great Tuesday, Royals. Don't forget to follow HSC TV on social media for more news and school updates.